So a doula is a maternity health care practitioner who works with couples um, and mothers to support them through the birth process. So they provide education, advocacy, support, and hands-on support in the actual labor experience. They're in the room with you when you deliver. There's also postpartum doulas that help moms after labor. So they're completely different from midwives who deliver babies like obstetricians do. They're more of um, emotional and psychological support for expected new moms. I'm going to spout off a couple of statistics around doula use in the U.S. Sure. And you tell me what, uh, what you think about them. So I read an NPR article recently published in 2016 mm -hmm. that said, I think by the journal birth, um, suggests that offering women the support of a certified doula could save Medicaid and perhaps private insurance real money nearly $1,000 per birth mm -hmm. by reducing cesarean sections and preterm births. Mm -hmm. Cesarean sections, about a third of all U.S. births, cost about twice as much as a vaginal birth. Yep. And one in 10 U.S. infants born preterm, so before 37 weeks, mm -hmm. incur medical costs 10 times greater than those of full-term infants. Mm -hmm. Other research has shown more satisfaction from mothers and better newborn APGAR scores, which yep. are a measure of birth's baby's condition at birth, yep. among mothers who use doula care. Um, it's a, you know, the American Congress of Obstetricians and Gynecologists said that guidelines for safe prevention of cesarean births say doula care is probably underutilized. Mm -hmm. And only 15% of mothers eligible for Medicaid covered doula services actually use them. Mm. Um, and that overall only about 3% of women in the U.S., although this was 2006, so it may, may have increased since then, but yes. only 3% of women said they actually used a doula during childbirth. So mm -hmm. given all of these, you know, reputable organizations and publications that are saying doula birth saves money, improves the mother-baby experience, improves yes. health outcomes. Mm -hmm. um, why is it so underutilized? Why isn't it the standard of care? There are real impediments to infiltrating a system that is designed to sort of put money first.